What's up guys, this is the NBA Professor here, and this is a basketball mail day video. I have six packages that have come in over the last, I'd probably say, three weeks or so. Um, a lot of high-end stuff I think you guys will be interested in seeing. So, uh, I'll start off from lowest to best, I guess. So first, got this. Picked this up for $0.10. Cents. Uh, Scotty Pippen, Bowman's Best, Die Cut, Insert, Best Cuts. It's a pretty cool set. And picked this card up for $2.32, I think. Uh, very nice Mike Conley rookie autograph from UD Premier to 50 Really, really underrated point guard. And then the next five cards are from the same seller. Uh, Magic Johnson, Pete Maravich, dual jersey, not numbered. Magic Johnson, dual jersey, uh, with Pete Maravich, excuse me, uh, to 150 so Both of them are the same, except um, this one is numbered, that one is not. But it has this like, green border around it, so don't really know what that means. And then here's a nice Bowman Sterling, Pete Maravich jersey card. Uh... That is numbered to 199 And then getting into the uh, pretty high-end stuff now. Pete Maravich, quad jersey patch to 25 from UD Black. Really nice Pete Maravich, um, dual jersey, dual patched from Exquisite to 10 Really rare card. I have personally never seen another one. So um, it's a pretty, pretty nice card. And then moving on here, it is a... One of one from uh, what is this? This is 0708 Tops Letterman, and it is a Pal Gasol game used letter patch. It's the O, and it's the O, um, yep, I mean, Gasol there. The X right there, uh, shows where the uh, which letter it is. So there's actually five of these cards basically with different letters for Gasol, um, but it's a really, really cool card. And then next, moving on to two really, really high-end cards. This card here I've been really wanting to get. Um, I think I've seen about three of them. And every single time I just get outbidded and I finally was able to get one. Uh, from Exquisite, numbered 5 of 10. It's from 0809 Exquisite, I believe. Dual autograph of Bill Russell and John Havlicek. Uh, I've actually never had a John Havlicek autograph in my collection. So I was very happy to pick one up. Uh, and this card I really, really, really liked. I love the design. And I, mean, I pretty much love all exquisite cards. Um, just because of their sleek design. It's very simple, but it just looks really classy. And you can tell it's a high-end product with all their autographs on card. Or at least most of them. Um, but a really, really nice autograph. Uh, this one will be staying in my collection. I don't see me moving that in the foreseeable future. And then the last one is another one of one there's a coa for it from ud black dual patch autograph of go from this side first james worthy and magic johnson and you can see a one of one right there it's stamped one of one so that's a very very nice card as well um in decent condition i mean uh, ud black cards do normally have um, corners that are dinged up a little bit, but um, but still a very, very nice card. I was really happy to pick this one up. Um, so, yep, there we go. Two one-of-ones. Very nice. I love the design of uh, the... I like the color they put in the blue. It's a pretty, pretty sleek design. So, overall, cannot complain. Um, some very, very high-end pickups. So if you're interested in anything, let me know. Um, I can tell you that this is not going to be available. This is not going to be available. And this one, probably not. These two are definitely going to be available. And all the other cards you saw are available as well. Um, I mean, this one's definitely not. That one, I mean, I would need really, really good offers. I mean, don't just because I say it's not available, I mean, you can feel free to offer. If you offer me something ridiculous, um, I mean, I'd definitely consider it. But... Uh, for the most part, those are going to be in my PC, so thank you for watching, guys. One last look at the one of one, and uh, I will talk to you all later. Please let me know if you're interested in anything, and also check out my for trade for sale video that I made a while ago um, that has all my high-end stuff and pretty much all the same stuff. I mean, some cards are gone, but it's only a couple. So if you're interested in anything in that video, please let me know. 
still don't understand the messaging system on YouTube now, so, um, I mean, I don't exactly understand the whole system they have on there now, but, because I can't get them on my phone like I used to on my inbox, so, uh, just try to PM me, I'll try to figure out if I can respond to you, um, and yeah, with that being said, thank you for watching, have a great rest of the day, rest of the weekend, and I will talk to you all later, peace.